I remember the first war. The way the sky burned. The faces of angels destroyed. A third of Heaven's Legion fell with me into exile. Now we watch from below as our brothers above battle each other once again. A war I once led has begun anew in my absence, and Michael and his loyal brethren stand now in defense of the word against the insurgent forces of Gabriel. Should Gabriel's forces secure victory, the souls of all humans would be forfeit in defiance of his will. Such an extinction of souls is an outcome that would benefit neither my father nor I, his outcast son. I have come here where I am mortal to recruit a second front against Gabriel's army. Their victory must not come to pass. library's closing in an hour. What are you still doing here? I thought you left a while ago. I'm working on these translations for Professor Merchant. Yeah, sure you are. It's more like you're hardly working. Why don't you go and get some rest? It's pretty late. Ah, uh, well, in a little bit, but he wants these translations by the morning. You know, it's the life of a grad student. Well, no one told you major in theology anyway. How's the work going? Uh, it's going alright, but I'm a bit weirded out by this book though. Professor Merchant didn't even tell me where he got it. But I found a few references to a tome like this. It may be a grimoire of the gash. A grimoire? What the hell's that? Well, there's supposed to be these manuals for black magic. But if this is a grimoire, it's really weird. There are actually passages in here that seem to be Judeo-Christian prophecies or something. You know, that must be why Dr. Merchant was interested in this book in the first place. Christian passages in a black magic manual? That's kind of weird, isn't it? I'm not as spooky as the nightmares that I've been having since he started me on this. Nightmares? Yeah, you know what, Alex? Don't worry about it. I think it's all the work that I've been doing lately. And then my sister... Uh, Lydia. She's still having problems with him, huh? Well, she's having all these problems with her boyfriend, and she's calling me every night. Uh... Yeah, well, she went home early today from work to go make him a romantic dinner. Well then, send my best. I'm trying to get some rest. Thank you. I'll be out of here in a little bit. And there were angels who could not accept the lifting of man above them, and like Lucifer, rebelled against the armies of the loyal archangel Michael, and there rose a second war in heaven.
closed ten minutes ago. I'm so sorry. You need to leave. I'm so sorry. sword of God. They seek to revoke my father's gift of souls to humanity. Should Gabriel succeed, you monkeys will be no different than the other primates you keep caged and prodded. Heaven will become all barren, populated by victorious angels whose rebellious pride will be second only to my own. I think one hell is sufficient, don't you? What do you want with me? This puzzle box opens a gateway to the labyrinth, a discreet domain of hell normally unreachable to me but not to you. You have a soul. It is your destiny to open the gateway and summon reinforcements to help Michael's army defeat Gabriel's. You want me to believe you're summoning reinforcements from hell to help Michael save humanity's souls? Why should I believe you? Why should I believe any of this? You've seen the visions yourself. If Michael's army fails to stop Gabriel, what souls would be left for me to claim as my own? The grimoire of the gash has shown you visions. You know in your heart that what I'm saying is the truth. Maybe, but I don't believe in destiny. My will is my own. Why should I help you? Because if you do this, I guarantee that I will forfeit your sister's condemned soul. Deny me, and when the time comes, I will watch her soul burn over and over and over for the rest of eternity. What about my soul? I have no interest in taking your soul. Only your services as proxy. In the end, there is only one question. What would you do to save your sister's soul? Anything. I do anything. Then solve the puzzle. 